the question is once you have completed once you have completed your DNA sequence, you want to know how many reads you have in your FASTQ files. So that's what I'm going to show you today. So before we get into counting the number of reads, I first want to show you how FASTQ file looks like. So if we do head uh, to just look at the top 10 lines of our FASTQ file here, you can see that here there are one, two, three, and four lines for each read. So that is one read, and then you have another read here. So information for each read in FASTQ file starts with this sign here at, and this is just a sequencer identifier. And then you have your actual DNA sequence in this case, I have 35 bases. And then you have a plus sign, which is just uh, separating your DNA sequence and the quality score. All right. So now if you want to count how many reads you have in your FASTQ files, you can do grep. And then you, since each read has four lines, but you want to count only this one line, the unique identifier in all these is this sign here at. So what you can say is that grep anything that starts, everything that starts with this at sign in our FASTQ file and then pipe this into the word count and I want to count number of lines. So this command is basically saying that in this FASTQ files count all the lines that starts with it. And then when I hit it, it will quickly generate this result. So now I know that this particular FASTQ file has 9.1 million reads. And that's how you can find out how many reads you have in your FASTQ file.